The Czech Republic came to exist as an ancient kingdom in the very heart of Europe. From the onset of Czech sovereignty, Prague was the center of the country. Thanks to her enchanting beauty, she has many poetic epithets, the mother of all towns, petrified beauty, or Prague, the city of a hundred spires. Prague is not unique in her magnificence. A thousand years ago, she had to fight for her privileged status with Kudna Hora. Silver was discovered here in the 10th century, and so Kudna Hora became a candidate for the capital. Her splendid historical center is adorned by not only one, but two Gothic cathedrals and a monumental ossuary. Chesky Krumlov also played an important role in Czech history. Here, architecture, history, and nature overlap in mystical ways. Like a velvet bow, the River Vltava envelops the historical center. The result is preserved houses built in Renaissance style in cobblestone streets where time literally stands still. Telch too was another example of harmony between architecture and nature. The town is rightfully referred to as Czech Venice. Against the backdrop of 13th century ponds stands the vast palace complex and marvelous Renaissance Plaza. The Renaissance influence was felt deeply in the Czech Kingdom. At the 16th century palace in Litomyshl, one can admire the original graphite decor as well as splendid arcade architecture. The plague column of the Holy Trinity stands as a legacy to darker times. It is said that God's glory celebrated through this column was so powerful that no war could damage it, and so it remains until today. The pilgrimage church of St. Jan of Nepomuk is a witness to troubled history. It was built by the architect Santini in a Baroque Gothic style and was inspired by the symbolism of the group of five. The five stars on a crown of the saint and martyr Jan of Nepomuk. The entwining of architecture and religion is also seen in Kromerzij, where the riches of the Olomouc diocese enabled the building of a beautiful Baroque palace and gardens. A symbol of religious tolerance can be found in Trebić, an absolutely unique symbol of religious tolerance. Here, Christians and Jews lived alongside each other and supported each other in amicable coexistence. The Basilica of St. Prokop, as well as the Jewish town and cemetery, with more than 3,000 gravestones, have been preserved until today. Dreams of a life in harmony were realized by the Liechtensteins. The compound of Lednice Valtice is the result of desire to create the largest garden in the world. This compound became the largest landscaping accomplishment on the UNESCO Heritage List. Ancestral heritage can be found in the simplest of things. The picturesque 13th century village of Holoshevice is testament of this. This quaint village is remarkable mostly due to its southern bohemian folk baroque facades and crests. The history of the Czech Republic reaches deep into the past, but was not spared of some truly fascinating modern architecture. The functionalist Tugendhat Villa in Brno, built in 1929, inspired the principles of modern living all over the world. The Czech Republic offers many unique opportunities to witness the past, to experience the present, and to create the future. Czech Republic, a country of many faces.